Hey guys, how do you do? Welcome to Russian program users. Now, we'll continue with the semantic IUI framework tutorials, front end development. Okay, so today we're going to see simple loading buttons right here. You can see these are loading buttons. Okay, we're going to see uh, how to make them pretty. Of course, where a semantic UI is just that simple, right? So that's it. You can see we can also able to handle, of course, uh, their item clicks to so get the exact item that's been clicked. So this, this is it. This is what we're going to say. Now the first thing, of course, we're going to go right here where we have our code. Okay. So we have our loading buttons right here. We can simply come. You go ahead, click it. Now, if you come right here, it's going to, of course, bring us to this particular page. Here's the URL. Right. So of course you guys can go ahead and download the code right there or of course you can also see we have also our code in our HTML as well as our JavaScript. Now if you want to edit the code just come right here edit on code pen okay so we want to be able to edit uh, this particular code of course on code pen to tie oh. so I'm going to go ahead edit on code pen right here is going to bring us to this code pen dot io and now you can see we have all our source code right here now the first thing that we're going to do of course is to add the dependencies okay so come right here we come to the css we're going to fetch our semantic uh, ui uh, buttons right here from a cdn right here so we'll go ahead and add this one then of course uh, for javascript we're only going to add the jquery dependency because we're going to be using jquery to select our buttons and then of course to handle their item clicks yeah then of course you save and close now if you come to our html you can see right here these are the four buttons we are having right here we give them a unique ids because we're going to be referencing them from our jquery then of course uh, the class loading right here now we have the basic we have the primary we have the secondary right here okay then of course in our jquery javascript right here first if our page is ready then we select button one we handle its item click if it's clicked we're going to show another dialog as saying button one okay the same thing to button two button three as well as button four you click save then of course you go ahead you can move to the full page mode if you're not logged in or debug mode if you're logged in is going to bring us to this particular page it's going to uh, give us of course our result right here okay so you go ahead it's go it's going to uh, bring us to this particular page right here if you go ahead click of course we're going to be able to handle uh, the button click and of course display that particular page that's been clicked okay also you can also see the result right here this is it guys this is course what we've looked at this is actually quite a simple tutorial just to show a loading buttons and then to see how to handle of course their item click events okay so i'm hoping uh, you guys have enjoyed the tutorial please if you have hit the like button share this uh, tutorial with us also view our other semantic ui tutorials and make sure that you give subscribe so that you don't miss any uh, lessons that we're going to have okay take care i'll catch you in the next class